Also, I'm just thinking about this. There's so many ways we can customize this. Look at right here. We put this vertical bar here. We could totally have local bar char. We could even take this as an argument, do whatever you want. And then we can do that bar char here. So we could change that. We could say, you know, maybe I want greater than signs. And then we rerun this and look at that. There's no rules. We could put whatever we want for the bar chart. We could put pound signs. And we could even make um, the empty character here as a string. We could make that like a period or something if we wanted to. I don't know why. You just, you come up with something that looks good to you. You come up with a style that you like. There's no right and wrong here. Um, empty char equals space. That way we can just control everything here. Cool. Technically speaking, we could put multiple characters in it and then it will completely break our logic. But what if we put an unprintable character in there? Now I'm, I'm totally just thinking as I go along here. What if we put an escape sequence and then we put something like um, open square bracket uh, 31M and then we had our bar jar here. And then we put at the end of this, the escape sequence zero M and close that. What happens when we run this now? It's in red. Now we have color. You can just add color to this. There's no real rules to it. There's unprintable characters. Just stylize that bar chart for you. How cool is that? That's super neat. I'm gonna take that out, but just remember that you could do that. I think it's pretty cool. We run this and hey, it looks good. 